We talk in our training classes about our physiology determines our psychology, which determines our actions. Yes or no? Everybody says yes. 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 I've shared this with you guys a little bit uh, last night at the cocktail party. Some of you guys probably don't remember. <laughs> but during the cocktail party, I shared with some of you guys I'm getting a hip replacement. I scheduled it for March 1st. My hip's really bad. I got complete arthritis. It's bone on bone in my right hip. My left hip's getting that way. But over the last three or four weeks, those of you that come in contact with me on a daily basis, have noticed my psychology has been a little wacky because I was in so much pain. So I went to the doctor, he scheduled the surgery, and then the next week he had me come in and he'd take a needle, anybody had something like this done, they'd take a needle of uh, steroids and cortisone, they put it in your thigh and shoot it up into your hip. I got off the table and it was like immediate relief. And my psychology changed right now, immediately, like that. We talk about our physiology, our body movements, our tonality, our, the insides, our cells, how our bodies work, how they affect our psychology, how we think. And we talk about how we think that determines our actions. And it's true, isn't it? Yes or no? Say yes. 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 All right, so to do that, let's uh, everybody stand up. Put your right hand up in the air. Put your left hand down here and give me a.